Hi, Dennison here, creator of Marine Diesel Basics, the first visual guide to marine diesel systems. Have you ever wondered how it is that when you put perfectly clean diesel in your perfectly clean tank, it can still come out dirty, even though there's no water and no uh, growth of yeasts or bacteria in the tank? You still end up with diesel as dirty as this, or as black as this. So welcome to the world of asphaltines. Asphaltines are molecular sized car molecules that are found naturally occurring in diesel. You get more of them when there's a mix of crude oils made to, you, to make the diesel and they increase with oxidation inside the tank. So slowly these can build up and in an extreme case you can end up with this black tarry substance. Here's my very very dirty fuel filter. Let's cut it open and see what we find inside. So there's what it looks like on the inside. There's the top. So we can open it up. It's just about free, I think, now. It's concertina, but there we are. So I can open it up and you can see just how absolutely filthy this is. And this was a on the engine. The engine was still running. That's quite a lot of filter material. Absolutely filthy. That's the dirty side, and that's the inside of the filter, the clean side. And this was all clean fuel going in, but oxidizing in, in the tank. It was not an exterior contamination. This is not caused by organic growth, such as bacteria or yeasts. It's not that. That comes out looking like a snot. This is those tars, and you saw in that photograph of what, it, what eventually happens is it turns absolutely black, and it comes out um, like soy sauce, like thick soy sauce. So another good reason for cleaning primary fuel filters regularly and for keeping an eye on them. And this is what can happen even with perfectly clean fuel going into the tank. And this is what's causing the darkening of the fuel. Well, thanks for watching. You may want to check out the new maintenance e-logbook. Keep all your maintenance records and reminders and a whole bunch of drawings of what to look for, etc. on your iPad or your tablet. And until next time, I wish you fair winds and a reliable diesel. Stay healthy, stay safe. Thanks for watching.